everybody! Welcome to the vlog. I've been wanting to do this for the longest time and now that it's been almost three years since I first came out with a five minute makeup video, a lot of things have changed. I mean, now I have two kids and some of the makeup that I used before, I changed but some I still kept. I have ones that I'm very loyal to but I also have ones that are my favorites, especially nowadays that there's just so many local brands that I love. By the way, this hair, slowly trying to figure out how to do my hair in five minutes as well because I think as a mom, that's all you basically have, right? <laughs> what I notice also with the latest trends is that people don't really like putting full on makeup or thick foundation anymore. So they said skin is in. So what I do now is I hydrate all the time. So one of my favorite that I discovered, best seller vitamin enriched face base products that you put on your skin would really depend on your skin type. For me, I have really dry skin, so I don't want to put makeup that I'll have lines later on. Okay, so I'm just gonna get a swab. Put here. I've been trying a lot of oils for the skin, and this is my recently favorite one. I wanna finish this first before I buy a new one because a lot of makeup artists recommend from Lumiere is also good. But right now, this is what I'm using. It's from Pixi, it's Rose Oil Blend. So I do two drops and I massage it on my face again. For me, this actually takes so much longer than putting makeup <laughs> because I really want my face hydrated. I mean, if, you're, if your skin is oily, I don't suggest that this is what you use because with the heat here in Manila and the humidity, I think you're just gonna be oilier and you might break out. Again, it really depends on your skin tone, but this I love and I like it to sit there for a few minutes before I actually put my makeup. So like right after I take a bath, I put the oil and I, I leave it there for like around five minutes. After that, put my eyebrows, which is very important. Okay, this has been a staple for me, but the benefit, see that's why, look, there's no more logo, there's no more sign because I use it all the time. This is the Benefit Eyebrows Volumizing Brow. My eyebrows and my hair color are not the same. Um, I'm supposed to be coloring my hair really so. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just gonna fill up. I like to fill things up with this K Palette Real Lasting Eyelash. I have like a hole over here, so I just basically fill it up. And what I learned when you use a K palette, you don't trace it, but instead you make like little hair rather than trying to color it like that. You just do little strokes. Is it even pantai? I also recently bought this Sunny's grooming gel. It's really nice, but you have to be careful on the amount that you put. I got the shade of my hair color, so I feel like when I put this, which is watch, it becomes the same color as my hair. Just to top everything off. Okay, so there you go. My eyebrows are done. This is it. This has been one of my favorites as well. This is NARS and this is color Talia. Mine cracked. I don't know if this is the same one I used three years ago, but still my favorite. One tip also that I got from makeup artists is that when you contour your face, you don't have to do the duck face and do that, but instead, you just look to the side and where your ears are and don't let it pass your eyeballs. So basically when you contour, you contour from here to here. So from here to here. I just like to brush it up all the way here just for a little color. This is my concealer. I've been using this for quite a while. This is the Stretch Concealer Medium and this is from Glossier. So I have dry skin and what I like about this is that it's very oily. <laughs> when I put it here, I don't have to stretch out my skin so much. And I just basically like to put here. I'm a huge fan of liquid blush-ons. One blush-on that I've been loving so much is the Becca Beach Tint. I've had this for years and I actually still have it because I hoarded when I was in the States. Just put a little bit. Basically, just tap. Try not to stretch your skin so much, but you just tap everything. Is that okay? I'm a huge fan of mascaras and I have different kinds for different occasions. So I have one that's a volumizer, waterproof. I have one 
also of another kind from Japan. Then I also have this. So it really depends, but for every day, I usually just use this. This is all Maybelline mascaras, and I think that they actually have the best ones. If I want to add, I put eyeliner. If I want to add, I want to join. You want to join me? Yeah. And just use this Marc Jacobs eyeliner, and I put it in the inside rim. And today I'm gonna join mom, and I'm gonna put some blush on and eyeliner too. But mom's gonna put it. I can't see you in the screen because it's very tricky. What's very tricky? The eyeliner. And there you go. This is basically my five-minute makeup routine or my everyday makeup routine. And during the day, I bring this Bath Origins facial mask. Yeah, and mommy sprays that in me. Like to spray and just feel refreshed because it's so hot everywhere you go nowadays, especially in summer. So it's just nice. Try new products. I try new items, and maybe I can just do more. Let's start the video and put makeup now. And maybe next time I'll do more makeup videos I'm with my favorite already. products. Yeah, okay, you can do it. For how to put lipstick, I love this Happy Skin lipstick. Mom, can you um, see this the is Ariel? from the Disney collection. Olivia actually told me to buy this because it was Ariel and under the skins, under the sea. So, and I will feature my favorite products next and time now because there's I'm just gonna have yes, you like this one. Yeah, but that's in the next vlog, okay? Yeah, I'm using that. With my, my everyday makeup routine. With me. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Maybe Olivia could do like a little tutorial. Yeah. Olivia's turn. Are you ready to make me put this on? I'm done, but you're Amelia's here.